when you say your back are hurting, you know, me, me can't tell you exactly what makes your back are hurting. Tell me why. You want know why your back are hurting? Look for your shoulder. That's why your back are hurting. That's why your back Blessed, blessed. Good morning, my viewers. Welcome back. Watch, like, share, comment, and subscribe. Six held as cops seize cocaine over one million doing operation in sentence. Six persons were arrested following the seizure of a 3.8 kilogram of cocaine, 55 year old, 55 pound of ganja, three motor vehicles, and over 1.3 million in coordinated anti artetics operation in Kingston and St. Anne. On Thursday, February the 8th, reports are that about 1 p.m. operatives from the Narthotics Division conducted an intelligence-led operation at a plaza in Ocherias, Sentan, where they intercepted and searched two motor vehicles. The search yielded a 3.8 kilogram of cocaine concealed in food packages in one of the vehicles. The estimate street value of the elusive job is Jamaica $18 million. An additional 118000 was also seized. Both men were taken into custody and the motor car seized. Shortly after 3 p.m., a joint operation was conducted with members of the Narthotics Division and Jamaica Custom Contraband Enforcement Team on the compound of the Norman Man International Airport in Kingston. During the operation, a motor vehicle was searched and over 55 pounds of ganja with an estimate street value of 540,000 was found concealed in a suitcase in the trunk of the motor vehicle. Lawman seized 1.2 million which was also found in the car. Subsequently, four airport ramp attendants were arrested. Two have been released following investigation lead. The identities of the four men are being withheld as the investigation progresses. Businessman shot dead in St. Thomas. A businessman was shot and killed by a gunman in York, St. Thomas on Thursday. The deceased is 42 year old shop and bar owner Delvin Hills Ailia Shot Boss of Shantytown, York in the parish. Reports are that about 8.30 p.m. residents of the community heard loud explosions and alerted the police. On their arrival, Hale's bullet-riddled body was found inside his business establishment. He was transported to the hospital where he was pronounced. Investigation are ongoing in the development. Spanish Town Security Indian among two book for two million Saint Mary Tef. Two men included, one from Spanish Town St. Catherine, have been charged with shop breaking and larceny and receiving of stolen property following an incident in Highgate St. Mary between Sunday, January 28 and Monday, January 29. They are 57 year old Robert Abu, otherwise called Indian, a security guard of Cole Lane in Spanish Town and 32 year old Lumberjack make machine operator Jerome Abu of Newport District in Rich Richmond St. Mary reports from the Highgate police are that about a man security locked up his business establishment and left on January 28 he returned to the following morning and discovered that the place had been broken into and several items including power saw and a tool pan collectively value over two million had been stolen. A report was made to the police and following an investigation both men were taken into custody. 
and charges were laid against them. They are to appear in the St. Mary Parish Court to answer to those charges. Over 2 million forfeited from farmer with illegal gun. The Financial Investigation Division FID was successfully in securing a significant ruling by the St. Elizabeth Parish Court on January 25, 2024. Cash in the sum of Jamaica 2.65 million was ordered to the Crown under Section 79 of the Proceeds of Crime Act POCA by the parish judge, Mr. Lawrence. This mark the culmination of proceedings, the proceedings which begin with the seizure of cash on March 2022 from defendant Burgess Clark, a farmer of Broadleaf District Address in St. Elizabeth. Man charged for a 2023 Maxfield Avenue gun attack. The police on Thursday have charged a man for the 2023 gun attack and another man who awaiting public transportation along Maxfield Avenue in St. Angel. 49-year-old labourer Maurice Dale, otherwise called Clarkberry, has been charged with wounding with intent, possession of a prohibited weapon, unauthorized possession of ammunition, and the using of a prohibited weapon to commit a felony. The Alpha Tree Police reported that about 9.45 p.m. on May 10, 2023, a man was standing along the road awaiting public transportation when a white Toyota Probox motor car with several men aboard drove up. One of the men then opened gunfire in the direction of the man, hitting him several times before speeding off in the vehicle. The wounded man was admitted in the hospital in serious condition. Daly was apprehended by a team of police during an operation. Operation on Wednesday, February the 7th, he was officially charged after an interview in the presence of his lawyer on Thursday, February the 8th.